bliss, bliss, bliss kiss. How are you all doing? I'm doing great. <laughs> Growing every single day, you know, like the trees, like the trees, you know. <laughs> I am the trees. And I am you, right? <laughs> How you all doing? How you all doing? I just took up, you know, it's morning for me here, you know? And it's bliss, 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 kiss, 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 you know? <laughs> I love to really, you know, experience and experiment on this human body, you know? And uh, lately, uh, I was eating like rice bread, usually I don't eat it, but I eat, and now I realize how, how it changed my body function, you know, so I've been cold for like a few days now, so yes, um, it's nice to try Indian food, you know, it's so tasty, you know, oh, it's so tasty! Especially this dosa, you know, <laughs> it's very tasty, oh god, mwah. Indian food, oh god, but today I'm staying raw, you know, I tried these three days, very beautiful meals, you know, most of the people, they are vegetarian here, and I love it, <laughs> but me as a vegan, I have to stay a little bit extra careful, because they do drink milk here and use milk product in dishes but where i am right now in a village mm, they're very clean you know and uh, organic grown vegetables it's it's good so today my topic is how to go vegan you know and it's i'm gonna talk about from my own experience how i go vegan you know before i even went vegan i was vegetarian you know I was vegetarian. Um, me, I'm I'm very extremely sensitive. You know, if when the truth hit me, I have to choose the best way for me. You know, and and I started as a vegetarian. You know, and when I was vegetarian, well, I was still. Uh, eating egg and dairy product, you know, and at the same time I was eating lots of, um, you know, f before I went even vegetarian, like, beginning of it, I was still eating fish, you know, and then, and then, uh, by time, as I was realizing that, well, fish is an animal too, I cannot eat fish fish, they're still alive, you know, and I'm still getting the fish DNA into me, you know, and then I stopped eating fish, so I was vegetarian eating eggs and dairy, and when I was eating eggs and dairy, I'm like, wait a minute, so I'm e still eating this chicken kids, you know, like the egg, egg, chickens comes out from these eggs, you know. So I was like, wow, that's not pure, you know, I was still getting the DNA, you know. So I stopped. I stopped taking dairy products and eggs and stuff. So I went to vegan. And when I went to vegan, uh, for me it was, you know, I was eating soy products. That means lots of tofu. I was eating tofu. I was just eating lots of corn, soy products, you know, which is not good. It's unhealthy, you know. But at that time, from the very first beginning of my journey, it, it was tasty and I was grateful because I had other options, you know, to eat, it was good. But by time, I was realizing that, well, I don't want to eat soy product. It's genetic modified, even if it's organic. It's genetic modified, also the corns. And as I was studying on it, and my taste just becomes strange. I don't want to eat that anymore. So I went for an alkaline diet. Dr. Sylvie recommended, you know. But still, even, you know, whatever bites, alkaline. But right now I'm in this stage where I am 90%, 95% raw fruitarian, you know. Whenever I eat cooked, I, I make sure I'm eating alkaline. If I don't eat alkaline, 
well, I may not eat alkaline once once in a month, twice in a month, or three times in a month, which is balanced, you know, like it's okay, you know, I can, I can stand with it, but I don't do it every single day, because my body will react on it otherwise, you know, if you want to be 100% alkaline, you can be, you know, I've been there, so now, now, I'm vegan, it's because of the animals, you know, animals, because I saw lots of videos and pictures also in reality show, like how the animals being treated, you know, how the kids, the, the kids of the animals, they don't get, they don't get any uh, food because of they're taking the milk out of the mama, they're taking everything from them, and that is why they cannot feed the kids because they want to sell their products, you know. So now, in this situation, I don't want to take that karma in me, you know. And at the same time, I'm realizing that, well, everything is information and DNA. So why am I going to put animal DNA into my DNA? It's not me, you know. So I'm pure vegan, and at the same time, when it comes to soy and corn product and stuff, even if it's organic, I don't want it because it's still genetic modified, you know, it's man-made stuff. I want all natural stuff that is God-made for me, you know. God made stuff I want from me because as I experience myself in my growth, you know, how do I feel, how I vibrate, well, I get stuck on this frequency, I just want to vibrate higher and higher, you know, I don't want to consume anything that brings me lower and give me the misinformation, you know, so now, now it's very important for us to really go vegan, pure diet, because I feel very clean, you know, you you may say, oh, you're going to die one day, so what, you know, body is illusion anyway, why? But still, we are still here, you know, we are still here and being aware of the avatar that we are in. So, so our body, our mind is the greatest computer, you know, so we have to really give it its own food that is natural, God-made food comes straight from the earth. It's very important, you know, because all the information, our brain consumes more nutrition than our body. So, you think what you eat, you feel what you eat, everything is energy. If you eat all these dead animals, that means that no animals want to be killed, especially all the animals that are getting farmed in the industries, they never get, they never allowed to see the sunlight. Some of them, they are never allowed to really be you know, really feel the ground. So I, you want to consume that energy? Okay, go and consume that. So you have to deal with it in the long run, you know. That's why most of the people, they are angry. That's why most of the people, they are, they are having fear, anxiety, and they don't even understand why they are having it. It's because of all the animals that they are consuming, all the energy. Animals, what is that? Everything is energy, you know. So now... Now when the chicken don't want to be killed or the cow don't want to be killed, so now it's being killed, you know, murdered, all this blood and shit, and then they wipe it with some water and then bring it in the table and you pay for it. You pay for it. So you pay for someone else to kill those animals and murder them, and now you, those death comes on your plate. The peace starts and begins from your plate, you know. So now... You are consuming all this energy. You are consuming all this energy into your holy temple, so of course you have to deal with it. And you don't even know why you are sad. Well, that animal, when it's been killed, it was sad. It was not happy because it didn't want to be killed, you know what I mean? So now you are consuming it. Most of us, they are depression. They are in depression. They fear. They cannot think right. They cannot manifest their reality right. Whatever you ask for, it, it, you don't get it because you are not pure enough. You don't feel. You feel what you eat. You feel yourself, you know. When you are an angel of this earth, you don't take part of any destruction like mother animals, killing blood and things. Because when you are part of it, you, f you don't feel that you are an angel. You don't. I didn't feel like I was an angel in my earlier journey. Right now, as me, as a vegan, oh my god, fruit tea, especially when I just eat raw fruits, 
oh my god so it's even more better because cooked food lower down my vibration because it have to digest everything and put, you know use more energy that means that we have to eat food that gives us energy instead of sucking the energy out of us cooked food sucks the energy out of us it cannot give us that energy but the raw food it gives the energy that's why i love to eat raw but just because of the taste and cooked food we've been programmed since we were a kid and we want to eat cooked food everybody's eating but whenever i eat cooked food i make sure i eat good cooked food organic cooked food but i make sure that i don't eat every single day i make sure that i take gap between you know so now now when we consume those all these energies so you may feel you may feel you are in depression, you may feel that you are not happy enough, you may feel you are angry, you cannot think right, and you, you come up with lots of destructive energy, lower vibrational energy, it's because you are consuming lower vibrational energy. So you have to feel it, you have to deal with it. So once you leave all that, nobody says that it's going to be easy, but this is how we reprogram ourselves. We are, I am strong enough. I am strong enough to be where I am right now. And you all are strong enough. Because it's, it's your journey. Nobody going to walk the path for you, you know. you got to feel it. you got to know it. Once you know and feel it and experience it by yourself, you will never go back to the same diet again. Trust me. So once you see your shift, once you feel your heart again, how angelic soul you are, what you came here to do, you will, you will know every single thing by time to time. But first of all, you have to detoxify your body, cleanse it out. And, and, and you, don't, you never have to even go to doctor again, because the nature is the medicine, you know. So now, how do you go vegan? Well, you start, you don't have to be hard to yourself, you know. You start by little, little. You go vegetarian first. You go vegetarian first, and then slowly but surely you move everything out of your side when it comes to dairy products. But you say that, oh my god, I love cheese, what's going to happen to me? Like, hey, seriously, you can let go of certain stuff in order to gain higher stuff, higher vibrational body. You know, you can let go of it easily. Because with me... I'm, I'm thirsty for my growth, my spiritual growth right here. And the water is my lifestyle that I'm living. <laughs> so now, now, it's easy when you go vegetarian. And then slowly but surely you remove the dairy products. And then what happens? If you are strong enough, you go vegan directly, you know. Hey, come. Wanna say hi? <laughs> Doggy came. So now, and then you start to drink more water, you know, you start to drink more water. You start to drink more water, juicing, fasting a lot, you know, cleans all the, all this parasite out that craves all the unnatural food. It's not you that, that crave all the food. It's not your soul. Your soul already knows what's happening, but the body got lots of parasites. Parasites that craves all this blood, all this sugar, all this gluten, poison, because it is their food to survive. If they don't get their food, they're going to get mad in the belly. They will be like, give me that. And then you run to unnatural stuff and you've been eating it, but it's not you. It's the parasites that is moving realize it so now you go vegan there is so many vegan products out there you know invest on your health when you invest on your health you invest on yourself you know you invest don't think about the money you know money will be attracted to you by time so you have to invest whatever you invest double will come to you why because you deserve it <laughs> I deserve it. Why? Because I deserve it. I'm the angel of this earth. I don't harm nobody. I don't destroy the nature. I don't kill nobody. I'm not taking anybody's milk. I'm not taking anybody's egg. I'm not doing any... I'm not taking part of that. 
you all may be think oh my but the taste taste well for me for me by being my natural self being tuned with my style within is my taste i can give up on few stuff because i have 80000 plus better stuff for me that comes straight from the nature without killing mothering taking from them okay gummy i love myself and i love every living creature that is on earth and it's easy it's easy when once you open your heart and you let love flow it's easy you know so this is what I'm doing, you know, I'm vegan for a life, I'm vegan, I'm gluten free, I'm sugar free, I don't take any poison, I don't drink soda, I don't drink alcohol, no, I don't smoke cigarettes, you all feel my energy, right? This is how we shift, this is how we vibrate all day long, whatever I feel about myself, the universe serves it to me. Some people say, well, when you are pure heart, whatever you ask for, it shall be given to you, you know. Yeah, I'm sitting here, I'm thinking about, you know, coconut water. Well, it might fly to me, you know. Magic works like this. <laughs> you got me? <coughs> so go vegan, change your diet, change your lifestyle, you know. Mm, vibrate on that angelic frequency you know even even if you're vegetarian you feel good in your heart you know because you are not eating meat but you're still eating dairy because you think ah oh, it's not i'm just taking but still because of you their kid is not getting the milk because of you those eggs never come into life with the kid like kid outside of that egg you know what i mean I don't eat brown sugar either, you know, the only sugar stuff that I want, it's that comes from the fruits, that comes from the fruits. I don't even eat honey, because instead of honey, I want agave syrup. Instead of sugar, I want coconut sugar, you know, coconut sugar. I want fruit sugar, you know, I love this, you know, and I don't eat gluten because gluten is poison, you know. <clears throat> if you do your research on it, gluten is poison. Gluten is not healthy for us. It brings you lots of disease and sickness. Because even if it's organic, it's not really gluten, gluten. So instead of gluten, I eat chickpea flour. Chickpea flour is good. Quinoa flour, you know, amaranth, and all these all this rich, rich flowers, you know, teff flour. I love it, you know, there is so many <laughs> better stuff out there, so why am I going to choose something that is not real, something that is not God-made? No, I don't want anything man-made. I want God-made stuff. I want richness in my food. I want, I, I can invest on my health just like this, you know, good stuff. You're such a natural beauty. That ten is everything that you may learn in shining through. Yes, Princess Parker. <laughs> this is spiritual growth right here, you know. I'm the healthiest being on earth, you know. But when you're around people who eat stuff that you don't eat, they may look at you like you are strange. Why you not eat like them? Well, I'm not you. I'm different. I'm higher vibrational being right here. On that level of frequency that I vibrate, you may not vibrating on it. How are you going to vibrate when you put lots of lower energies within in your vajra? While well, you may feel love, you are good heart people, but still, still, you have to vibrate on that level of frequency. When you experience that, you, don't, you never go back to the same thing. This is what I am saying, you know. So you have to try it. <laughs> go vegan at least for a week and try it. Eat raw for at least for a week, only fruits. See the shift, see how you feel, see how your thoughts change. One week after three days you shift. <laughs> you start to see everything differently and feel different, you know. It's all about that lifestyle, baby. <laughs>
I'm glowing, you know, I'm glowing is because of, wow, my skin, the way I move, you know, I've been drinking coconut water almost three months soon, no plastic water, oh, if you could feel what I feel, oh, God, you will never go back to drinking water again, I mean, that plastic bottle water, even if it's spring, you know, <laughs> So yes, my loves, I love you all. Go vegan now, you know. And st when you go vegan, don't think, oh, I don't have anything to eat. You have 80,000 plus plant-based stuff, fruit and vegetable there. Eat lots of nuts. Eat lots of chia. Eat chia seeds, avocado, sesame seeds, you know. Fruits, all this banana, all this coconuts, all this... <coughs> oranges, grapes, strawberries, melons, you have so many things to eat, make smoothie out of everything, blueberries, all these berries, you know, vegetables, all these green leaves, make salad out of cucumber, red cucumber, cherry tomatoes, you know, avocado, spinach in it, you know, tea, lime, make, make vegan sauce, you know, out of all these nuts, you know, just put it, mix it and shake it, shake it and eat it, it's so good, you know, all this good, coriander, oh my god, kales, woohoo, make wrap, you know, woohoo, raw wraps, damn, Always put ginger in it. I love ginger in my everything, okay? <laughs> I'm able to make smoothie today with lots of ginger in it. Oh, mom! <laughs> Life is good. You eat what you feel. You are what you eat. So, be alive and dance in the rhythm of unconditional love. We are the angel of this art. Hey, da -da -da -da. <laughs> so, hey, I love you all. Mwah. Thank you for watching and share this video. Share this video and right now I'm starting my meditation for three hours. Ow, ow, ow. So see you all soon, you know. Bringing down the information from higher dimension to, to down to this dimension. And I'm here to share everything to you all. Because the wisdom lies within everybody and God is here. So I'm just receiving the blessings and I'm here to share. So follow me on my YouTube channel, Spiritual Warrior Saving Souls. And share this video. Mwah. Love ya.